doubt it. Yeah, I doubt it for real. This is my first time making this song. I'm making it how I want to make it. I don't want to hear nothing about, but I don't care. Walk in your trap and take over. Over. Name another bitch that's called. I just bought a brand new Rover. Rover. I don't even drive no more. I got a show. Took off, man. They asking me to slow up. Took off. Getting wiser and my money getting older. older. And that bitch, I ain't even gonna hold it. And that bitch, I thought that they told it. Ah, I miss you guys so much. Hey, Bougie Babes, it's the Barbie, and I am back with another video. If you're a return subscriber, hey, if you're new here, do not forget to subscribe and join the Bougie Crew because it's the Bougie Runaway. Period. Period. Big dive. Big purr. <laughs> but, anyway, so. I am going to be doing a cooking video finally for y'all, but before we even get into the video, um, like I'm gonna take a shower and stuff, but I guess like before I get in the shower, I'm gonna put the potatoes on because we're gonna make jerk salmon, okay? I love salmon, that's my favorite thing to eat. Salmon is like seafood, like seafood boils, my favorite. So the other night I had made Tuscan pasta, Tuscan pasta, Tuscan shrimp and chicken pasta. Um, I'll make that again for y'all soon. I know a lot of, of y'all want to be on that. I know y'all want to be on my stuff. Salmon, um, a whole bunch of stuff. So today, like I said, we're gonna start with the jerk chicken. I mean, the jerk uh, salmon. I've been craving it and I feel like, this is my first time ever making jerk salmon. I think I've done jerk shrimp before, jerk chicken, but I haven't done jerk salmon, so I'm excited. But I just got home from the office, so I'm gonna wash my hands. Like I literally just walked in the door. So I'm gonna wash my hands and we're gonna start. We're gonna go ahead and put the potatoes on and let them boil because we're making jerk salmon, mashed potatoes, and probably broccoli. I was gonna do asparagus, but eh, I think I'm gonna do broccoli. I like broccoli, so we're gonna do broccoli. And yeah, so let's get to it. Let's wash our hands. So I'm so excited. I've been waiting to cook this all day, y'all. So, I let my salmon thaw out while I was gone. So, it's just some salmon like this from Tom Thumb. Tom Thumb Salmon Atlantic Filet Premium Center Cut. So, it's just a center cut, so it's gonna be more of your thicker side, okay? And we're gonna cut it in like threes, one, two, three. So we're gonna have three pieces and yeah, I think the skin is on here, which is fine. I sometimes I do get a skin list, but it's fine. The skin is still, you know, it's still no big deal. So let's get our pot. We need our cutting board. I haven't gotten bought me any knife yet, you guys. My knife set that I want is on my Amazon registry, my custom gift list. So I'm gonna see if somebody's gonna buy me a knife set. If not, I'm gonna buy it myself. Um, but yeah, so we only got this knife, so don't say anything. My other knife, um, yeah, I, I did have a big knife, but it like when I put it in my dishwasher, I guess it like, it, like got rusty because it was like wet in here, so it kind of got rusty and I had to throw it away. So don't laugh at my um, my utensils. Okay, so we're gonna fill this with water. All right, so we're gonna turn our burner on. Y'all, it was so hard for me to learn how to work this stove. It was so hard. Look at me pressing buttons now. And I still don't know how to work it all the way. I still don't. How do I cancel this? There you go. Okay, so we're gonna use the front burner, which is the biggest burner on triple heat. We were doing triple heat. Cause I'm so hungry, y'all. My potatoes gotta cook fast, so look how ready it get real fast. <sighs> okay, so we're gonna put this on there. And we're gonna put our potatoes in.
Okay, so we got our potatoes inside, red potatoes. You can you can use the other potatoes, peel them, and you can do whatever you want to do. I leave the skin on my red potatoes because I like the skin on my red potatoes. So, yeah, we're going to let them boil. We're going to let them get done. And then once them get done, that's when we're going to start the video of me making the jerk salmon. Um, I might go ahead and cut up my bell pepper and stuff. Not on camera. I'm going to do that. Yeah. I ain't gonna do that on camera, I'm gonna just cut it up. And then so once we get there, we just speed, you know? Move fast, speed it up, okay? So yeah, I'll see y'all when I get out the shower. Okay, y'all. So I just cut up some jalapeno, bell pepper, um, green bell pepper, red bell pepper, and some onion. Now, so I was gonna make my salmon, like I was gonna um, put this in a bowl, put the jerk seasoning in a bowl, cause I'm using this. You can get this from Kroger, jerk chicken. Maybe even Tom Thumb, but I got this one from Kroger. And this is the spicy one because I love spicy. It's Drake marinade. So I'm gonna be using this um, for my jerk salmon. And I was gonna put all this in a bowl mixed up, but <clears throat> I should have let it marinate while I was gone earlier with the salmon and everything in a bowl. So what I'm gonna do instead is I'm going to <clears throat> saute my vegetables with garlic, some olive oil, and then um, I'm gonna add in the jerk marinade with that. But first, I'm gonna cook the salmon. So this is basically gonna go, I'm basically gonna drizzle it on top, is what I'm gonna do. This is my first time making this, so I'm making it how I wanna make it. I don't wanna hear nothing about, but I don't care. I don't care what recipe I can look up. This is how I'm gonna make mine, because this is how I wanna make it. So, with that being said, Cause y'all know y'all love to check people in the comments about how they should cook. But it's like, everybody cooks different. Like literally everybody cooks different. So, <clears throat> I'm gonna put my vegetables in a bowl real quick so I can cut my salmon on this. So the potatoes are not gonna take too much longer. Um, so my salmon, we have to take it out. And I'm gonna cut this into threes, like I told y'all I was gonna do. Okay, so now we about to season these. Okay. So I'm gonna season with this Jamaican jerk uh, seasoning that I got from Kroger a while back. Garlic powder. Black pepper. Cayenne pepper. I don't know where my, pap my paprika is. I love spicy, so. Yeah. And then some Dash Flavorful Original Blend Seasoning. So boom. This is how the salmon looks, seasoned. That's how I look. And 
So now, what's next? I'm going to... We're gonna start sauteing the vegetables. No, we're gonna we're gonna do the salmon first because the potatoes are almost done. Basically, the food is basically almost done. So I'm gonna cook the salmon first. I want it to be crispy, so I'm gonna make the salmon and then then we're gonna make the jerk sauce. I mean, you can do it at the same time. Yeah, we're gonna do it at the same time, so that way it'll get done like around the same time. So, let me check out my potatoes real quick. Okay, so the potatoes are done. So I'm about to pour the water out of the potatoes real quick. So we can do our mashed potatoes real quick. So the rest of this is gonna be easy. While we are making the mashed potatoes, we're gonna go ahead and make our, um, saute our vegetables and put our jerk and stuff in here. So, let's turn this burner down. Vegetables, jerk marinade. I got some crushed pepper. Um, garlic. I love garlic. So I got some garlic. And then, y'all, I was gonna make jerk salmon with like Alfredo pasta, but I didn't think of it until after I put my potatoes on. I was so mad, but anyway, so. Put this on medium heat. Add in your garlic. I'm turn up a little bit more and put it on like medium high. Now we're not gonna add the sauce in just yet, but we're gonna add a little bit of olive oil. For our vegetables. And while those are like sauteing, we finna do the mashed potatoes. So, let's go over here. Hold on, let me run my dish water because I need to wash dishes before I eat. butter and then some heavy cream Milk, but I use um, heavy cream. 
makes it really creamy. And I just love the taste of it. And you can use regular salt. I use garlic salt and pepper, but you can use regular salt. I got this from Jai, and I love it. So that's that. Parsley flakes on top. I'm going to brighten this down a little bit. I'm going to do a taste test. Mmm. Okay. So now, back to the vegetables. Now we're going to add our jerk in here. This can really be turned down. Shake it up. A little more long way. This that jerk stuff is really strong. Mmm, it smells so good. salmon in here afterwards. Put it in there and more. But oh my god, this smells so good right now. Put some peppers in here, fresh red pepper. I love spice, y'all. So I don't know why. You don't have to put this much. I love spice. Now I have it on low and I'm just letting that simmer. Now I'm gonna make my salmon. Look how good these vegetables look. Look how good these vegetables look. <laughs> jerk seasoned with jerk, spicy jerk sauce, <laughs> marinade. I wish I could smell it. Let's finish up. All right, so now we're gonna do the salmon. So let's move it over here. Mashed potatoes are done. I'm gonna put these in the microwave. I usually make, you can make like baked mashed potatoes where you make the mashed potatoes and then you layer them and put cheese, layer them again, and then put cheese and then like chives on top and baking bits and put it in the oven. But I'm not gonna do all that, I'm hungry. Okay, so, the salmon. Boom. So we're gonna turn the burner on dual medium. So I put some of the whipped butter at the bottom. This butter is so tasty, that's why I use it. It's so tasty. So I put this at the bottom. And then garlic. Okay, so butter, garlic. And I think I'm gonna put a little bit of jerk marinade on the salmon, hold on. Like just a little bit on top, you know? And like rub it on there. Face down. Put it in there face down so we can get that crispy top. And we're gonna let them cook. While it's doing that, I'm gonna wash dishes, I'll be back.
Okay, y'all. So I'm gonna use this broccoli. This is like a steamed broccoli. You just put it in the microwave like this. Um, yeah, easy, easy. So that's what I'm about to do. This stove totally just messed me up, messed my cooking up. Like, I guess it was up too high. Like, I, I don't know how to work this stove that much. I told you at the beginning of the video, I've, I've learned, but I think I'm still learning. Like, this has never happened when I'm cooking my salmon. Like, y'all be seeing me on Instagram doing my thing, and today, I don't know what happened. So anyways, yeah, so let's just continue this video <laughs> so I can be done because I'm hungry. I'm not digging. I'm not digging the video. Honestly. But I'm going to keep going for y'all. This is how it's supposed to look, like this. Last time I burned it on accident because my stove was too hot up. Like, so it's supposed to look like this. Y'all see this? Hold on. Ooh. It's supposed to look like that. That's the jerk marinade on there. But, y'all, like I said, this stove be tripping with me. Hello. I already knew. I mean, it was still spicy, but it wasn't like I wanted it. 